Hi there. Yes, I'm wearing a cap today and I don't think I've ever worn it in a video before. Have I? I think maybe once. But anyway, the reason I'm wearing a cap today is because I have these noise short rush TWS earphones. Now these have those ear hook designs that hold on to your ear from the back so that the earbuds get a good grip and obviously it was not possible to demonstrate that with a bandana so I'm wearing a cap today. So the first thing about these earphones is that it has good battery life, it has an equalizer, it has low latency mode for gaming, it claims to have IPX rating and good sound quality. So after a lot of requests, here's the device, let's unbox it, let's test it, let's see if it's worth your money or not. But before we begin, subscribe to my channel and press the bell icon so that you don't miss an update. Also follow me on my social media handles for more tech info. This is your friend Texting. Let's get started. So here are the noise shot rush earphones, wireless sports earphones, noise branding here. On the back you can see it says secure sports ear fit, low latency mode, 6 hours playback, full touch control, IPX5 water resistant and 3 modes of equalizer. Here you can see that it has some details and here the price is 6999 but you can get these for 3999. Alright, let's open this. So inside the case we have some paperwork, you have a 200 rupee discount for your next purchase on noise products, some paperwork, some instruction guide. So we have 4 extra ear tips, 2 extra pairs, 1 come along. You have a micro USB to USB charging cable, that's so sad because it would have been so good to see USB-C. And finally, the earphones. Alright, let's move everything aside and have a closer look at it. Wow, the finish and quality is top notch. It's really good, it's nice, soft. You have the noise branding. They call it charcoal black, but it's kind of grey because it's charcoal colour. And uh, the case is made of soft plastic. On the back here you have the noise branding. Here's the micro USB charging port. I so wish this was USB-C. And alright, let's open it. Oh wow, you can see the build quality, the case. And it just reminds you of the Power Beats Pro. Wow, they're just actually kind of a rip-off of the Power Beats Pro, but at a fraction of a price, which is not a fraction, I can say, but quite cheap comparatively. So nice, hook is nice. But let me tell you that the case is definitely not pocketable. It's quite a thick, big case. And that's obviously because of the earphone design. The earphones are such that they can't be more compact than this. All right, let's move them out and see. So it actually looks like the Power Beats Pro, but the build quality is genuinely impressive. There you can see there's a light turning on, it's the pairing light. The build quality of the hook is so nice, the soft silicon, it's really flexible. So shouldn't be a trouble wearing for long hours. You can see that the lights have turned on, terminals on both sides, cushions really soft, silicon tips. So you can even see mics on the top, so you can use these for phone calls as well. Let's put them back in the case. Hold on instantly. And they're magnetic and they start charging. And they're not going to fall off anytime easy. Build quality top notch, case quality excellent. Really soft plastic, really nice. Let's pair them to a phone and see how well they perform. So first thing we're going to do is go into the settings, Bluetooth, turn it on. Just opening the case and pulling the earphones out of the case. And there you see, short rush will show up. So the pairing process is extremely simple. There you go. Okay. So finally, it's time to see how well they fit. And the reason I wore a cap is because of these. Okay. So basically, they go behind your ear so that they get a good grip. And they do. Oh, and the moment I wore them, I could get that sound, that beep sound, which said it's connected. And does it happen on the left one as well? Yes. Oh, wow. So, oh man, they're so comfortable. And these are those uh, rare earbud earphones that don't totally block your ear. I can actually hear myself while I'm talking, and which is so great. And uh, it's not totally blocking it. I can feel that there is still comfort it's not totally sealing off the ear of course i don't need to tell you that but because of the hook it's got an amazing grip it doesn't even shake just 
perfect it's held on really well so when it comes to the comfort and fit as of now that i'm wearing it it feels really comfortable i can barely feel i'm wearing anything and uh, even the hooks behind the silicon hooks they're not too tight they're not like clipping on to your ear they're just holding on to your ear just giving them that perfect fit it's really good when it comes to the fit so if you are thinking of wearing this even while watching a movie or while gaming they are definitely very comfortable all right something that's very important the sound quality let's test it okay uh bass lovers don't touch it yeah see i'll be a little blunt here if you love bass then these lack bass they're pretty flat when it comes to the bass uh, maybe if i change the uh, the ear tips there might be a little more bass if i use the other ones so how about i change the ear tips that i think would fit me better maybe that helps me to get a better bass let's change them first all right if you change the ear tips and uh, which also took me like around 30 seconds or pretty tight but uh, that's okay i don't think that should be a problem because our main concern is better fit and better sound quality started playing hold on okay okay so so i think i'm getting a better seal also now after i changed the ear tips and uh, wow that's actually feels even better so let's play now and see okay okay so uh, of course i've worn it for a very short while but yes after changing the tips the bass was a little better but a little better uh, it's not like it has great thump even though it has those earbud design but still the bass was not amazing the bass is decent you get a decent amount of bass the trebles in the mids are pretty good the surround sound effect was actually quite good so now i'll let you know that actually this even has three equalizers and uh, let me change the equalizer it has rock classic and pop so you have to four times tap on them yes it has tap gestures which i'll come to in a minute which will enable it to help improve the sound quality what you want some like more trebles some like more bass i think i'd like a little bit of bass a little bit of treble it should be a well balanced sound right now i'm feeling that the bass is a little too less and maybe more of mids and highs so let me try to move to rock and see if that helps okay 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 so uh, in the rock mode the bass was really really improved i thought it would not be that good but in the rock mode the bass is pretty good pretty good i'd say above average if not great it's still above average it was much better than what i thought it was when i heard it for the first time mids and highs pretty clear and even the around effect the whole surround music effect was pretty good they're not bad they're not great but they are above average when it comes to sound quality they are pretty 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 good so these earphones also come with tap gestures as i mentioned before and the benefit is that you don't need to reach out to your phone for changing tracks or even volume yes the best part about these short rush noise earphones is that it has tap gestures literally for everything so we know that most of the earphones miss out on the volume but the noise rush don't single tap on either to pause and play press and hold on the left for previous track press and hold on the right for next track double tap on the left to lower the volume double tap on the right to increase the volume triple tap to enable voice assistant so if this is connected to an iphone it will enable siri if you triple tap on the right it goes into gaming mode yes it has a low latency gaming mode and the best part is noise claims only 85 milliseconds of latency it should be amazing for gaming as well as when you're watching videos and movies it also comes with three preset equalizers like i mentioned before you have to four times tap on either of these sides and it will toggle between rock pop and classic so you get your kind of sound profile that you want on these earphones that is amazing time to do the gaming review and see how's the latency So the PUBG experience was stellar. I could not see any delay with the gaming mode on. Absolutely brilliant. I'm so surprised to see that TWS earphones are getting so good in improving latency. 
in fact i even watched some videos and the audio video sync was almost perfect noise did a really good job with these so i know many of you also want to know how this is for phone calls because eventually when you're wearing this you're going to wear them outdoors indoors gym or in the house you want to make phone calls or receive phone calls so of course i've just unboxed it but i still made a couple of calls one to someone who was still outdoors and one to someone who was indoors the person who was outdoors claimed that i had little echo in my sound of course from his end i could get a little ambient sound but the call quality was pretty good then i called someone who was indoors he didn't realize that i was actually not using my phone he said it was really really clear but i still feel that outdoors this will struggle with good sound quality so as much as you try using these indoors they're going to be absolutely fine coming to the battery so i did use it briefly and the battery seemed to be quite good and frankly i had expected that noise claims 6 hours on a single charge wow even after using it for 2 3 hours it was barely at 65% can't expect more a fully charged case will charge these about 4 times giving you a total of 24 hours of battery it takes the case about 2 and a half hours to fully charge from 0 to 100 and it takes the earphones about 1 hour all right finally should you get these wait 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 pehle let's see its cons firstly the case is too big to fit in your pocket unless you're wearing pajamas <laughs> you know i know the design like this smaller case is just not possible even the power beats pro have a similar case so we'll let go the size of the case we have no choice but micro usb port seriously come on guys let's just get rid of this usb c even would have supported fast charge anyway maybe i'm overreacting but usb c would have made this almost perfect almost so in my conclusion i actually like these i didn't think i would but i really do it's comfortable great fit perfect for gymming perfect for workouts ipx5 water resistant gaming mode touch controls above average sound quality and amazing battery life sab kuch to aa gaya aur kya chahiye ha price well this is priced at 3999 which i think is quite good for the quality and features you're getting It's also available in wine red and quick silver colors. You can buy the color of your choice. It's great. If you are a sports enthusiast, then these are going to be even more perfect for you. I'll leave the links in the description. You should definitely check them out. So I hope this video was helpful. If you have any questions regarding these, kindly mention them down in the comments and I'll be happy to answer them. Don't forget to like, share and subscribe. Until next time, cheers.